<laughs> this is gonna be funny. Hey guys, Jason here with Flight Reviews with a quick tip for you. Today I'm mounting the engine on our Extreme Flight 91 inch Yak. We're gonna be using the DA60 with a Blazing Star mount. And I just wanted to show you a quick tip that I have for getting these holes drilled out. As you know, you get a quarter inch bit, they're gonna try and walk off these markings that Extreme Flight is nice enough to include for you on the plane. So what I like to use is, I like to use a countersink bit. You can see that there, that's nice countersink bit. And what we do is we start with this, close to center, and we just drill a little bit, make a little mark. We're a little low and right, so we'll go ahead and move up and left, a little up and left pressure till we're centered. We'll get the leaf that just fell off our tree out of the way. And now we have a nice centered hole. So what we're gonna do is even pressure, nice and centered, until we've got a decent amount of countersink in there. We take this bit out, Put our quarter inch bit in, our normal quarter inch bit. Go ahead and drill through, making sure not to drill into our fingers. You can also use the countersink bit to clear up any uh, breakaway you have in the back. Just to show how nice this works, we've got our Blazing Star mount, that's set for the DA60. Everything locks in perfectly. So there you go, quick little tip on how to drill out your uh, motor mount holes on any engine really, on a firewall that's pre-marked but not drilled. Hope this helps guys.